You're looking at Boeing's most advanced, most delayed, and possibly most important jet in decades. After years of silence and scrutiny, the 777X is back in the air. And this time, it's not just a test plane. It's the first new 777X aircraft to fly in over five years. And it could finally signal that Boeing's biggest bet on the future of long-haul travel is nearing the finish line. On August 6, 2025, Boeing's brand new 777-9, registration W. WH-286 took off from Payne Field in Everett, Washington, climbing to 39,000 feet and cruising at Mach 0.84. This isn't a typical test aircraft. It's a production model, one step closer to commercial service. WH-286 won't collect general flight data. Its mission is specific, testing resilience to electromagnetic interference and lightning strikes, a critical step toward FAA and EASA certification. The 777X itself is a technological marvel, the world's largest twin-engine jet with folding wingtips for airport compatibility and powered by the GE-9X, the largest jet engine ever built. Boeing has racked up over 550 orders for the 777X from major global carriers, but delays have plagued the program since 2020. Flight control issues, pandemic slowdowns, and regulatory scrutiny following the 737 MAX crisis all pushed certification back. And competitors like Airbus have gained ground with the A350-1000. Boeing now aims for certification by late 2026. The success of WH-286's first flight gives hope with Captain Ted Grady calling it a beautiful flyer and praising the teams behind it. But the pressure is on. Boeing must prove the aircraft's safety, efficiency, and reliability fast. With long-haul aviation poised for a new era, the 777X could lead the way. If Boeing can stick the landing, would you fly it? Let us know, and don't forget to subscribe to the Travel Deck for more.